Welcome from the home of the Mets, City Field in Queens, New York. A great night for baseball ahead on the show. It's the San Diego Padres going up against the New York Mets. First pitch coming your way next. So almost ready to get underway and towing the slab in this one. Matt Harvey. Chris, what are you looking for from him? Well, he had to shake off that last start. He was outstanding. Had double-digit strikeouts. Just couldn't get the run support that he needed. Pitched very well. We'll see if he can come out today and repeat that performance. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound. The pitch before felt like he should have had him looking, I think. But, you know, that's good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch to get him to swing and miss. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Well, anytime you can punch out the top two guys in a lineup to start an inning, got to be feeling pretty good out there on the mound because when you think of just having a distraction, table setters on the base paths, and all of a sudden you're dealing with a number three hitter, any distraction can cause you to serve up a cookie, and instead of it being a solo shot, it got him. Strikes out the side to begin the game. What a start. Nothing doing there for the Friars. Now the Mets offense will go to work for the first time. No score. You're dialed into the show. Back here at City Field. And today's starting pitcher, number 34. Very dominant his last time out. Picked up the win. Only allowed one run. These guys would love to see him back on his game in this one. And stepping in for New York, Scott Hairston. Out to short. On the run, throw to first. One up, one down. Let's take a peek at the Mets lineup here. This is an offense, Chris, that's having a hard time scoring runs right now. Yeah, sometimes things just aren't going to click. And unfortunately, what happens is guys press, they try to do a little bit more, and they get out of their game. You've got to let the game come to you. If you chase it, it's going to run from you. So this is a team that just needs to calm down, relax, and understand that they're going to come out of this. Can't get their base hit. That is third. The third base hit. And at first, so up next for New York, David Wright. Homered in the ball game yesterday afternoon. The pitch. Swing, and this one's bounced to the ground. Barely got him for the out. Close play. Next is the cleanup hitter for the Mets, number 21. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. This one chopped on the ground, but foul. Murphy at second with two down. And that one goes straight to the backstop. He's in there. Murphy up to third on the wild pitch. Have to be really sure you can make it safely to third when you're in scoring position and two outs. Got to get that run across. Very important. Does a nice job of reading it. Gets to third base now just 90 feet away. Payoff pitch. Swing and a miss for the strikeout. Couldn't catch up to the heater. Mets leave one. Scoreless after one. Welcome back. And stepping in, the rookie left fielder, number 18. Number 18. Here's a 1-1. One -one. Bounding ball here, rolls foul. Fights it off, you'll see another. And a pitch. Fouls it off, still one and two. Now this is in the air down the line. Nobody can get there, and it's a foul ball. Here's a one-two. Bounce to the right. Murphy 
Tosses to first and quickly one away in the second. That is it. The designated hitter. Number Stepping in for San Diego, number 20. One down, base is empty. Fights that one away, still one and two. The pitch. Swings and misses, struck him out. Yeah, there's no doubt, Boog. Electric stuff from the jump. I mean, there's just no messing around right now. It's still very early, but we could see a pretty impressive outing here if the strikeouts keep coming in the way they are. One thing you have to be aware of, though, is a high strikeout rate might impact the pitch count as the innings roll on. That one gets down for a hit. So a two-out knock keeps the inning alive. That is that is the second Next base. for the Padres, Orlando, Orlando Hudson. Hudson. Didn't play in last night's game. A little breather for him. On a line, base hit. They stopped the lead runner at second. Now two on with two outs. A couple of singles back to back. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. One's in the cage. You're just hoping you get. Now this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. It's gone over the left field wall. That one felt good. His second of the year. It's 3-0. When you're working with this kind of velocity, so critical that you move the ball around, work quickly, and make sure that you keep that hitter off balance. Clearly not fooled by the location or the velocity. He was all over that fastball. And now the shortstop, number three. The pitch. Just misses the mark outside the zone. In the air, out towards right center. Puts the squeeze on that one. And that's the third out. So a three-run shot for the Padres here. It's now 3-0. You're watching Major League Baseball exclusively on the show. Bottom of the second. Here's a big power threat. Ike. Davis the first base is hitting for Aye. that pop. Came Aye. out of the gates really strong. Well, after scoring runs, this is where you're looking for that shutdown inning. Get that hot team back in there to swing the bats. There's a swing and a drive. That's back there. And that one is out of here. Home run number five on the season, and they cut into the deficit. It's 3-1. Chris, he's homered in back-to-back -back games now. Yep, seeing the ball well, and he's got his timing locked in. He's looking pretty dangerous at the dish right now. Well, I'm sure there's a big grin on his face right now, Boog. He's probably had some of those that didn't stay fair, but off the bat, it looked like he was going to bend foul. Was able to keep it in there, tucked it nicely, and he gets the jog around the bases. Good for him. And now it's going to be number nine. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. Got it by him for the K. And now the Mets DH, Ronnie Cedeno. Ball to strike, the pitch. Swing and a line drive, base hit out of the center field. Just kind of sliced that one into center. You'll often hear that the again. phrase, short to the it, catcher. long through it. Number and number. that's a great example of it right there. Got the barrel in the hitting zone early, squared it up with the well-timed swing, and came away with a beautiful line drive in the center field. Ball to strike. And that one fouled off. Hit on the ground, might be two. The throw to second, 
and that's two. Mets do get one back, though, on the solo homer. And this is now a 3-1 ball game. On to the third inning at the play, Will Venable. Hammer, base hit. Now Will Venable Double with his three. first major league hit. And this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen. And when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming, dude. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but it's great when you can take a minute to just... This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And caught on the warning track. Thought that was a no-doubter. Like the wind was holding that in this ballpark. Number seven. Number seven, the next up for the Padres. Went down on strikes his first time through. In the air, left field, down the line. Squeezes it, out number two. Now bad, bad. Number 18. And next will be the cleanup hitter. Number 18, grounded out his first time. Swing and a ground ball out to short, and it gets by him. Just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock. Now the batter now, number 20. Davis pulls that one down, and that'll do it. No runs on two hits, no errors, and two men. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And stepping in for New York, Tejada. Swing and a miss. Slider right there. Clearly he was sitting on a fastball right there and just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him for his commitment. Now he's just going to have to battle with two strikes. In the dirt, on to first, gets him. One away on a drop third strike. And next for the Mets, Scott Hairston. Grounded out his first time up. Here's a 1-1. That's the third. Rolls across the diamond. He's out. Good fade and sinking action of that changeup. Got that hitter to roll over. So here's Murphy now. One for one with a single so far. The 1-1. One -one. Swing and a miss. One ball, two strikes. Into center. Makes a nice grab at a full sprint. And that is that. Down in order go the Mets. And they still trail it here. Three to one. All set for the start of the Lead inning. And now the switch hitting catcher, catcher. Number 12. Number 12. The 1-1. One, one. That's out to center field. Great effort as he's able to haul it in. And there's one down. So digging in now for San Diego, Orlando Hudson. Singled and scored his first time. Swing and a ball lifted left field. Flashes the leather on the run and catch. And there's two down. Number 13, the next up for the Padres. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, will be a very positive sign. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that'll do it. I think the key is arm action on the changeup. When you can sell it like a fastball, you drop the velocity, you get the swing and miss, and you walk off the field. And welcome back. And now David Wright. 3-2. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. He's been pitching well, but going through this middle of the order second time through, we'll see what kind of adjustments are being made. Popped up. Puts it away for the out. Now back. Number 21. 
Number 21 up now for the Mets. His first at bat was a strikeout. The 1-1. One, one. And that's a little bit high. That misses three balls. three balls and a strike. He hasn't fallen behind in the count like this all day. He's in danger of walking his first batter right here. Hey. Swing and a miss. Three and two now. Left-hand hitter waits. On the ground to third. Slings to first. Already two gone here in the home fourth. The the so up next for New York, Ike Davis. One for one so far today with a solo homer in his first at bat. Two outs. That one drifts inside. The idea was right, looking to locate that fastball up and in. He just missed his spot a little bit. 3-2. That one 95 to finish him off. And the Mets go down 1-2-3. And it remains a 3-1 ball game. New inning getting started. Stepping in is the switch hitting shortstop, number three. Number three. Ground ball up the middle. And the leadoff yeah. bid set down in their half of the fifth. Oh, but we talk about how the ball is coming out of a pitcher's hand. The way it comes out of his hand as an infielder. Wow, really impressive. So digging in, Will Venable. One for two. Swing and a tapper. On to first. Oh, they get him, but it was pretty close. Now batting. Number 23. Two outs, base is empty. And now, Alonzo. Almost drove one out of here last time up. Flied out to the warning track. And now, maybe extra bases. Now he'll turn for second. And that's a double. Well, here we are, third time through the order, and this is where we see the OPS jump up. Manager might have to go to the bullpen a little bit sooner than he anticipated. Next to hit, number seven. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. 1-2. Fouls that off to the left, and we'll do it again. Clearly trying to stay back a little bit longer for that changeup as he fouls that fastball back. Stays alive. also really good at bat. What I like about this guy, his bat stays in the zone for a long time. Gives him the ability to foul off tough pitches. Slings it across. Third out. No runs, one hit, no errors, and a man left. Home half of the fifth coming up. It's the Padres three and the Mets one. Here in Queens, John Chami with my buddy Chris Singleton. It's set to get us started. Bottom five, number 76. In the air, right field, number 13. Drifts towards it, makes the grab, one away. Up next to the Mets. And now the Mets DH, Ronnie Cedeno. Picked up a base hit to center his first time up. And right back to the mound. Sends it to first, and a couple of quick outs. The bat, bat, number 30. And here is number 30. 
0 for 1 so far. And a pitch. On the ground right side. Inning over. Nothing across here this half. Five innings complete. It's top of the sixth inning. Here's the cleanup hitter for the Padres. Number 18. Next offering is foul back. The one two. Spoils the two strike pitch and he'll see another. The wide the kick and the one two. Battling here as he fouls it away. Riding to the plate. Foul ball still a one and two count. Bell having such a tough time putting him away. Six foul balls in a row. Man, what a battle. Fouls it back with two strikes. The wind of the pitch. Fouls it off, still one and two. Right hander kicks deals. Little bouncer out in front of the plate. Tosses to first. Now one gone in the top of the sixth. Now the DH for the Padres, number 20. Gonna count one and two. One ball, two strikes. That's to third, and it goes oh, just foul. One, two now. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. Foul ball still a one and two count. Kicks and deals. Fights that one away, still one and two. Eighth pitch of the at back coming up. And that one is lifted in the air. Number nine should have this one. And he makes the catch. Two away down. Two outs, space is empty. Stepping in for San Diego, number 12. That one finds the zone. And now two and two. This one lifted in the air, left field, Hairston settles underneath it, puts the squeeze on it. That is the inning. No runs, no hits, no errors. 9-1 and 2 scheduled to hit in the home half of the sixth. It's the pot. Back here at the ballpark, there's the shortstop at the play. Tejada. High fly ball lifted in the air, right field. And makes the grab. One down. Back to the top of the Mets order. Now the left fielder, Scott Hairston. To third. Zips it across. That's six straight set down. Good arm side run and sink on that pitch right there. Got inside on him and got him to bounce into that out. Daniel Murphy will hit next. The 1-1. One -one. Liner, and that should be extra bases. Now he turns and heads for second. The throw in, and into second easily with a two out double. Really good swing right there. He got a pitch that he knew he could handle, allowed himself to stay back just a tad bit longer, and he hit the ball on the screws. David Wright up now for the Mets. This guy is one of the best athletes in the sport. It's softly on the ground, left side. Tosses to first, gets him easily, ends the inning. Mets strand one, score holds, it's 
We go to the top of the seventh. So digging in now for San Diego, Orlando Hudson. And here comes the Mets manager to the mound. Pitching change coming. Matt? So the Padres have chased the starter. Number 60. Just trying to keep this one close here. And this is where a bullpen can give their guys a chance to fight back into the game. That one lifted to left. Hairston in position. He's there. He's got it. And there's one down. The why to kick the pitch. They're now two balls and a strike. Just missed. This is a really good feeling for a hitter. At this point in the ball game, you know that they don't want to walk you, so you're going to get a pitch to hit. You just better not miss it. That one ripped left field. Hairston raging back towards the wall. Back some more. Pulls it in on the warning track. Well, off the bat, I thought for sure it had enough to get out of here, but that wind's kind of blowing in from left, and I think that's what made the difference. Keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball. Here's a one-two. That to right. Number 21 under it. He's got it. And that is out number three. Padres down in order. And the score stays three to one. Bottom of the... Seven. And the batter now, number 21. Here's a 1-1. One, one. That one fouled off. Well, these Mets do a great job, Boog, of just waiting for the right pitch to come their way. And I'm seeing very patient at bats out of them. The starter's pitch count is high because they've worked the count full against him five different times. Their pitch selection's been off the charts today. One and two now. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. And that's the first out. A big first out here in the seventh via the punch out. Yeah, it just now, does so much to change the outlook of an important inning like oh, this. I mean, you got the leadoff hitter yeah, yeah, yeah. so critical in setting the table when you got a tight game like this. So a strikeout really puts them on their heels. Two up, two down. Good two-seam action right now, there. Now. Running away from the batter. Now. Rolled over it. Got the ground out. So two down now. And here is number nine. The 1-1. One, one. In the air to left center, number 18. Has this one sized up and puts the squeeze on that. And the inning is over. Welcome back and a new arm on the mound to start the eighth. Mejia. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of them right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. So the batting order turns over, and now the center fielder, Will Venable. And a big swing and a miss. Swing and a base hit. Really nice job of two-strike hitting in that at bat. Showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy, didn't try to pull the ball. He let it get deep, took the barrel One right ball. to it, and then Two extended strikes. through the swing for the line drive base hit. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Bounced, and that got the pitcher. Throws oh. the first. Just got him on that one. Next for the Padres, number seven. Swing and a miss. That's strike two. One out and a runner at second. Line drive, base hit. Venable coming home. He will score, and they lead by three. Big at bat to pad their lead up to three. Nice line drive to the pull side right there, but he didn't spin off of it. That's the key. You still have to extend through the baseball in order to hit a line drive like that. 
Here's the cleanup hitter for the Padres. Number 18. One for three. Swing and a miss. And the count is even two and two. Fights it off. He'll see another. Two, two now. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Oh, nothing too fancy on the strikeout pitch right there. Just a low 90s fastball. I'm not sure he was trying to challenge him, but that's pretty much what happened. Very hittable location, but he found a way to just get it by him. Fly ball down the line. He can't get there. It's a base hit. The relay. Not in time. He's safe at the plate. And they're up by four. Well, the ball that should be caught isn't because of a bad angle, bad route to the baseball, and allows a huge run to score late in this ball game. So, man aboard, number 12, the next up for the Padres. Runner at second, two down. He goes down looking. They get two runs on three hits, no errors. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth, Nick Minson. This is his fifth appearance of the year. Now pitching for the Padres. Number 15, Nick Minson. Ronnie Cedeno up now for the Mets. The Mets in striking distance, but have some work to do. Do Boog, it starts with the laid off man. I need a good at bat out of him right here. Swing and a line drive and a base hit up the middle, and the lead off man aboard. Wow. So important to get into the fielding position after you deliver that baseball. That is a scary one. Watch your lips. Man at first and stepping in for New York, number 30. And a 1 1. That one laced to center and a base hit. Lead runner to second, so two on and nobody out. I'm sure he feels really good about that one. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones. Gotta make them pay. Now let's see if they can string something together, make it a little more interesting. Right-handed reliever. Swing and a tapper that rolls foul. Here comes a pitch. High fly ball, shallow right field. Number 13. Couple of steps in. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one away. So up next, Scott Hairston. And a pitch. Now a screamer into the outfield. And there's two away. Now, now, now it's the second baseman, Daniel Murphy. There's a 1-1. Popped up. Pulls it down, and he makes the catch. And the inning is over. Two left on. Ninth inning coming up. It's the Padres five, and the Mets one. The Mets with a new arm on the mound. G. He pitched yesterday, and we'll see him once again. And now it's the switch inning second baseman, Orlando Hudson. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. 
And he deals. Fouls it off. Still one and two. The wind in the pitch. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Swing and a ball hit out towards left center field. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one down. So digging in, number 13. He's already homered here in this one. And he grounds one back up the middle. Fires over to first. Two up, two down. Two outs, base is empty. Now here is number three. This one high in the air to left center. That one hops against the fence. And that's a two-out double. He was all over that one. I love the approach he had right there with that pitch. Not trying to do too much, but still looking to drive it. And that's exactly what he's able to do into the opposite. He's under it at short, puts the squeeze on it, and that'll do it for the inning. No runs, one hit, a double, no errors, and one man left. Hard of the order, 3-4-5 will get their shot in the bottom of the ninth. It's the Padres. Tommy Lane into the game. And he's got a nice lead to work with, so he should come in throwing You're strikes, lead. attacking these hitters. 3-4-5 due up for the home team. Digging in, David Wright. Worm burner into the outfield for a knock. Now it's the right fielder, number 21. 1-1 one, one now. On the ground, right side. One at second. Oh. Out with the pitcher covering. It's a 3-6-1 oh. double play. The 3-6-1 double play, in my opinion, is one of the toughest plays to make. You've got a pitcher covering first, and the middle infielder throwing to a moving target. Everything has to be perfect, and right there, they made it look pretty easy. Ike Davis up now for the Mets. He's already homered in this game. Good job to fight that one off. In the air right field. Number 13 under it. He's got it. Ball game. The Padres take game one of the series on the road. It's always nice to grab the opener of a series. You come into a new ballpark, and just sometimes things aren't as comfortable as what you've been used to. The mound doesn't look straight. The background isn't what you like, but they didn't let any of those things distract them. In fact, they looked like they were playing a home game. Excellent job to set the tone for this series. 5-1 is how it ends. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby. Thanks for joining us. The final, final line score. Line score. Hello there, baseball fans. Let's recap what went down around the league on Wednesday. Starting off in the National League East, the San Diego Padres got 12 hits in this one as they took care of the Mets at City Field 5-2. Dan Harris.